What's up everybody? My name's Rob Simmons and welcome to my channel. As a request, I'll be back to the Diana Iganova perform her Christmas song, Santa Please. Before we begin, don't forget to subscribe or your notification bell because I publish new videos almost every day and I take requests from subscribers. All that being said, I always look forward to reacting to Diana, so let's get to it. I hope I translated the song title correctly, but that venue is just beautiful. Take it away, Diana. Here we go. Цветы не забыли полить, чтобы весной распустились цветы. Oh. Я прошу очень мало, всего лишь любви. Дед Мороз, я прошу очень мало, всего лишь любви. Дед Мороз, If that doesn't fall on your heartstrings, I don't know what will. Obviously, I don't speak Russian, so I'm just trying to interpret what the meaning of the song is and how it relates to those kids. I have a few theories I'll share afterwards. Real sparklers? I would have guessed that you use your phone. I was feel a little choked up with that. Oh, real snow! Nice. That guy is doing a great job as Santa. If somebody can translate that in the comments, I would appreciate it. Another excellent video from Diana. As always, she knocked out the bargain, performed it brilliantly. In fact, I don't think there's a song that she cannot perform, and that's how talented she is. And the video itself was done really well, cutting back and forth between Santa visiting those little kids and Diana performing this 
on the piano in front of the audience with the sparklers. It was just really well done. Oh, with the real snow as well. And I was thinking that this is this might be an emotional song that those kids, my two theories were, those kids were refugees from Ukraine or sick kids in the hospital, but they all looked healthy, thank God. You know what, let me check to see when this video was published. So it turns out this video was published in 2021, before the Ukraine situation, so both of my theories were inaccurate. And it was really cool to see how a Santa dresses up in Russia and how it differs from the US. In fact, I think it would be really cool to see different Santas from different countries, but that's another video for another time. All that being said, let me know in the comments what you think. Thank you for watching.